You guys, look at Bath and Body Works perfumes. Well, guys, so I'm finally home going through my finds, and I did not notice in the first clip because I was just so excited. I threw everything in my car, but look at this. These are Victoria's Secret Love Spell Mists. I found this in a Bath and Body Works dumpster. So obviously they got the wrong shipment. They are owned by the same brand. So maybe there was just a mix up. So they couldn't sell them. So we just tossed them. I have four boxes full of Love Spell sprays. Hey guys, just left Ulta. I saw this bag, so I grabbed it and left because I saw some makeup products in there. And guess what? It looks like. Da, 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 da. Dose of colors. So it's a bunch of dose of colors testers. Let's see what let's see what these look like. Oh pretty, they're just shimmery eyeshadows. And then we have these ones, which is maple. It's an ideal duo, loose pigments and a primer, so Here's the top, it's like a cream eyeshadow. And then underneath is a really pretty pigment. And that's what those look like, super pretty. There's a few of them. So here's more, I actually found a Lime Crime lipstick. Here's all these. That's a really pretty blue. It's um, smashed, but I can fix that. There's a black. So I'm home and I just wanted to give you a better look at all the Dose of Color single eyeshadows that I did find. They are testers. And they are so freaking pretty. I went ahead and repressed that blue one. But these are all of them. And I'm just going to go ahead and disinfect them. And I'm going to show you what I do. I put some rubbing alcohol in a spray bottle. And I spray these quite a few times. And then I'll take a napkin or a cotton swab. And I will literally scratch off the first layer. Get in there. Really scrape it out. And then I will spray it again and let it dry and that's all i do and it seems to work just fine for me but these are all the colors so pretty love that and then here are all of the glitter toppers that i was able to find we have some really pretty colors there's golds there's like red colors there's glitters there's golds there's silvers there's whites champagnes so pretty and they did come with a cream eyeshadow on top. So each of them have a corresponding um, like cream eyeshadow. And I will do the same like I do with the single eyeshadows. I will spray with rubbing alcohol. And then I will take a cotton swab or paper towel and scrape off that first layer. And then I will spray again. And that's how I disinfect all like the powder products and cream products that I use. Just got back from dumpster diving. Picked up this bag from... Bath and Body Works, it's kind of heavy, so I just popped it in my car. Now we're going to go through it. Hopefully there's some good stuff. It honestly kind of just like looks like a lot of trash. I'm hoping there's something good. Looking down in the bottom of the bag, and I'm seeing the goods. So let's see what there is. We have pumpkin pecan waffles. It's half burnt. I'll use it up and then I'll recycle and reuse the jar. There's also lemon mint leaf. It's a little dusty. Looks like they threw like their sweeping trash in here as well. I'll clean it off, but that's about, I don't know, 85% full. Something broken. It is a white gardenia. It's got quite a bit left. I'll either repot it, reburn it, or I'll use it for wax melts. There's a vanilla bean Noel, and it's still got quite a bit. These are all burnt, so I'm assuming they're returns, people trading in scents that they didn't like. There is a strawberry pound cake. It's pretty burnt down, but I'm just going to reuse the jar. We have a single wick in fresh water. Also found aromatherapy sleep lotion. It's pretty full. Let's see something right here. Underwater Oasis. This one looks different. What does A mean? Or D damage. Like there's a car air freshener. It's just broken. Like the back got snapped off, but you can still use these. A wallflower plug. 
and a whoa what the where's the front a shower gel in I have no idea there's just sunflowers and the last few little things are a hot spring spa essential oil mist I did find the cap and then I also found a car freshener in what is this twisted peppermint that's all I found this at Joann's it's a Polaroid 3d printer it's in there and then there's like some other junk um so i'm gonna see if i can fix it hey guys so here i am just putting together the 3d printer that i found everything was included the wires everything here's the box i kept it just to kind of see what i'm doing it's pretty cool i found it at joanne's instructions everything's in there it's so cool you guys so it came with like this pink wire that's what you use to make stuff and it also came with like little discs um that way you can like download how to do things so far i've only made a little star it was kind of hard i'll figure it out as time goes but can you believe they threw this away that's the inside it's just a cool little contraption guys i'm at tj maxx i see some canvas art i think some of them are sliced but i'm gonna take a peek at some of them Fix these. Somebody else will find them and fix them. But yeah, what a shame. I'm at five below. There's a bag right there. I need to get in and get it, but it's so gross. All right, I'm gonna get it. All right, cool. Found a bag, some paint, and then two other bags. I'll go through it when I'm done dumpster diving. But five below. I'm at a different five below. It's filled with cardboard. But when you move it, I see some stuff right here something right here I'm gonna get these out so this is two different five below hauls we're just gonna go through them here's a little overlay let's get to it first up I'm gonna start off with the things that were out of the bags this is a two-tier fabric storage shelf as you can see pretty nice I found one of these before and I still have it so as you can see it's you can stack them that's pretty cool you can make it higher some charging cables, more charging cables. What is this? A lavender sandalwood candle. I don't know if it's broken. Not broken. Here's a extension cord, one that has multiple things on it. A clear iPhone case. We have some slime. A whole thing of paint. It just looks like one of them spilt, but 24 paints. A Bluetooth speaker, one that looks like it changes colors. Some headphones. More charging cables. And then a two pack of canvas, but just the back one is cut so you can still use the first one. Next up is this, this was in my trunk. I'm not sure if this is from Five Below or Barnes and Nobles because I did stop by Barnes and Nobles too. But this is a rock and roll rainbow um, piano. And it just makes noise. It's like a little piano mat. My daughter's excited. Just gotta charge that and see if it works. Okay, we have a really cute fluffy decorative pillow. And let's see, we have a little pink vanity mirror. It's battery operated. I found these before. It's in there. The LED light strips. I have a bajillions of these. I don't know why they throw them out because they're never open. As you can see, it's still sealed. It's never been tore open, but I like to use these. We have some little furry sandals. Some leggings active leggings in size small an led gaming mouse pad it lights up on the sides some pink sandals might fit me some candy noodles a wireless optical mouse headphones 
it doesn't even look like it was open. It just looks like the box was a little damaged because they're still in there. We have another LED mouse pad. These are really fun to have. An iPad screen protector. I'm not sure if it's broken or not, but I'll find out later. Another pair of workout leggings in this really cute tie-dye. Some sunglasses. These just fell out. An ankle wrist weight, two pounds. So here they are right here. We have a smartwatch and ear pod holder display thing. And another pack of these LED light strips. Now moving on to this big old bag. It was ripping while I was carrying it. Um, so let's get started. We have a unicorn book. It looks like it was supposed to have pens. It has a coloring pad. I will definitely use that. Ooh, what is this? I think this is a hammock. I remember these from summertime. I believe this is a hammock. Okay, so we have some kind of Bluetooth speaker, more headphones, a, a SoundBreeze wireless diffuser, headphones once again in a really cute case, a podcast streaming mic, it's in there. Oh, this is cute, um, a salty beach bag, it's just so salty, perfect for the beach or the pool. Some Crocs. I guess they broke off right there, but you don't really even need those straps. So I'll just donate those. More charging cables. What is this? Oh, I've seen this one time I was in there. I was looking at it. A portable charging bracelet. Stuff. One of these wristlet keychains. Wireless headphones. Always find these. Little blanket nails a worry stone another oil diffuser uh the other pair of crocs Ooh, another led paper or lead paper lantern i found one of these already and i love it i have it up there on my thing it lights up by batteries so cute what is this puppy styling head we have another stand for earpods and a watch blanket. Looks like it's a sloth blanket. So that's cute. You just put your head in there. More headphones with a built-in mic charging cable. A neck pillow. A speaker. It looks broken. And a uh, brush cleaning liquid. It's actually a brush holder. Guys, I have two bags from Five Below. It's full of swimming shoes. They're perfectly fine. There's all different sizes. There's a few other different types of shoes. We have these in here. Dresser, flats, a whole bunch. Sandals. I'm just gonna donate those. This was freaking crazy. A bag full of thermometers. A full bag full. I'm gonna keep a few for me and my family and then I'm just gonna donate the rest of these because what a waste. 